You know guys, sometimes you just gotta take a step back and appreciate some of the finer things in life. Like San Pellegrino, lemon flavored specifically. No, this video is not sponsored by- Oh, I just- Oh no. No, this video isn't sponsored by San Pellegrino, but I wish it was. San Pellegrino CEO. Uh, I'm waiting on it, I'm waiting on that sponsorship offer. Uh. Guys, today, like I said, we're taking a step back, keeping things chill. I thought today we could look through some showcases because there's a lot of them on Roblox, but it's never really something you would just do a video on unless, of course, like we're going to be doing today is going through a bunch of them and appreciating what Roblox is capable of. And today we'll be starting with Totoro. Probably one of my favorite Ghibli films. If you haven't seen it, e what are you doing? Hmm? And here we go. Starting off. A beautiful view. Oh man. And guys, let's let's just try to remember. Like this is Roblox, alright? The types of things you see in Roblox compared to this is pretty wild the kind of uh the the variety that you get. Hello, hello, hi everyone. Excuse me. I want to go to Totoro's house. Actually, no, sorry, we're going to... Man, look how nice this looks! Wow. This makes me want to take a sip of my San Pellegrino lemon flavor. Buy today at your local store is what I would have said if I was sponsored by them, but I'm not, so I will not say it. Genius, please say hi. <laughs> hi. <laughs> Why am I dying right now? Oh my god, I don't know. Are you okay? Should, should I call someone? Look at this. This is so gorgeous. Look at the detail. Walk on up here. Come inside. Wow. Look at that. Okay, sorry. You know what? I'm getting a little bit too excited. Like, this is chill video. Chill video, guys. We need to... <laughs> okay. Look at this. Walk around. Got these books everywhere. Hmm. Yes, yeah, very good. Very good indeed. Come inside here. Oh, wow. You got the you, the light coming through the window and here in this room. And what is the purpose of this room? Nothing. It's an empty room. Wow. Okay. You know, not the best use of space, if I'm being honest. Wait, hold on. What is this? Is this a shower or a toilet? I mean, I'm confused. Like, how do you get rid of it? You just kind of stomp it down the drain? Hmm. Interesting little bathroom there. Okay. I'm probably just being uncultured. Also, you're blocking the doorway, sir. Sir, thank you. Hmm, okay. Very nice, very nice indeed. Can I jump through this hole? Oh, I can. Wow, I love this house. Come outside here, come into the back. Hmm. Now this is very cute, and I love it. It is cute and brave, but most importantly, cute. Look at this, you got so many sponges in this house, there's sponges everywhere. And I wonder if they would have those little, like the, oh, I remember this room, that's where they took a bath. Yes, the bathroom. Oh, wow. Whoever would have thought that that's why they called it the bathroom. Now, hold on, you guys, the lighting's getting a little bit weird in here. I think it's because it's window. I need to end the darkness. Despair. Hey, there we go, much better. Man, I've made now what? 2,500 videos, maybe more, if we're, especially if we're including the pals, like upwards of like 3,000 videos. Um, and my lighting still sucks. I know. I know, guys. It's one of those things. It's never going to get better. I'm sorry. <laughs> People somehow just get it. But you know what? Oh, I'll tell you one thing. If there's one thing that I have to say, as great as this was, I'm done with it. Thank you, Totoro Showcase, by set default one. That was very good, but you know what I think we're gonna do next, ladies and gentlemen? Haku. Interesting, could this perhaps be Haku from Spirited Away? Hmm, who knows, man. I am really enjoying the feel and pacing of everything that we're doing here. It's keeping me relaxed, calm, and collected. And sometimes that's all you need. You go into so many of these Roblox games, and all you see is colors and screaming and usually dying. But today, I wanted to change it up. See this? Beautiful. I like, uh, you know, I don't know if this is from somewhere. I wouldn't be surprised. It's a very cool design. You walk into, oh! Some sort of ghost knight haunting the treehouse. What is this? Is this a cat? No, it's just a, it's a lump. <laughs> I mean, it could have been, I don't know, from this angle, as I was coming around here, there could have been some sort of little head. I don't know. What is this place? 
So this is the bathroom, I guess. But where are you? Oh, no, this is probably the bathroom right there. Right, right. Okay, man, this would be such a great little reading area slash desk. What a view, man. And then you got a cute little bed here. You know, this is this is a nice showcase, you know, I do like it, but uh, I think the other one to 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 had more to offer, but I have a theory. A game theory. Was this also made by- it was. It was also made by set default one. Wow, very good. I could tell they both kind of had the same, you know, whole shtick going on, right? Well, why don't we now go with a bit of a contemporary approach? Also by set default one. Oh my god. So this person, they just absolutely love making the- wait, what? Did they get a Bloxy Award? Fifth annual Bloxy Award. Oh wait, you can just buy it? Uh, you used to be able to buy it? Or maybe they did actually get a Bloxy Award. This award was given out to the winners of the annual Bloxy Awards, honoring the best game creators, builders, artists, and video makers. Wait, does that mean I have one of these? Because I won a Bloxy Award. <gasps> I want to check. Sorry guys, hold on. Taking a bit of a detour in this video. Bloxy Award, where is it? Show me. I want it. Uh, do we go, is it gear? No, it's not gear. What is it? Where's my Bloxy Award? I I want a Bloxy Award. I, I want I want I want one. <laughs> Was it for shoulders? How do you get a Bloxy Award? I'm confused. Did they maybe not give them out this year? I don't know. Well, guys, I'm not too sure. I don't know if I may, maybe you guys know if you know you know any, anyone else who won the I because because this year this year I got a Bloxy Award. I, I, but but I don't I don't think I got a trophy like this and that would be pretty cool, but that's okay I digress. I would like to check out this Le Quatre Jardin. I don't know if it's French actually it might, it might not be I don't know. Wow Okay, it's got some nice little music going on. Hello yeet bot yeet bot 4321 Oh Jorgi Oh no, this is the place of horror, clearly. One thing I can say is this music right now, as beautiful as it is, I bet it's not as beautiful as the music Rob plays. I'm just saying. Wow, so you can you can see the streets outside? That's very nice, very cute. But then we walk in here and we got an indoor-outdoor garden. Lovely. So this is some bougie house, looks like. Very nice. Perhaps it is in the evening. A little bit gloomy outside, but that's all right because it's got wonderful lighting. A electric stove. Prefer gas ranges, but that's fine. Whoa, big old bookshelf with a ladder, of course. Very nice. Little Star Wars memorabilia. Man, we're just like sitting down, hanging out. Hey, Jorgi. I'm gonna, you know what? I'm gonna let them know exactly what I'm thinking. Oh, <gasps> he's sitting beside me. What? No, Jorgi, come back, please. I was enjoying our conversation. What? What? Jorgi? Oh my god. Parkour master. <laughs> wow. He's clearly not in the mood to talk. That's fine. <gasps> Look at this little setup here. Very cool. So, it seems like the owner of this house isn't much of a gamer. Because this is no gaming setup, that is for sure. Pitiful. And then over here... <gasps> Whoa! The way that door opened. Cool. So you can sit on the toilet. Wait, can you? <gasps> they don't let you sit on the toilet. How modest. How... Um, I don't remember what I was saying. Where I, Where are we? Who am I? Nice little place here. We got 2D baby. <laughs> Alright, well. Yeah, the same same kind of bathroom. That's alright. You know, not too bad. You know, this is kind of like... This is like a, like a house tour sort of thing. Speaking of house tours, guys, if you uh, if you haven't heard, I've said this a couple times in videos, is uh, my house tour, because this is a new house that I just recently got, you know, because of the whole pandemic thing, um, it's, uh, you know, the, uh, there's been some delays on its completion, so uh, still waiting on some things to be done, so whenever I do a house tour, I want it to be as best as it can, you know, so uh, I, I don't want to be showing around a incomplete project, right? Wow, look at this. Oh, beautiful rooftop balcony. Oh, I like it. I like it a lot. But can you just like fall down there? I mean, I guess you just like shouldn't jump, you know? Like that's totally doable. And they got these little glasses here too. Man, crazy. I would hang out up here all the time. Wow, beautiful. Guys, that was a little bit more of a uh, 
modern mansion, you know. But now, I say... We go to the Nevada Outpost 5. We're in the apocalypse. Also by set default 1. And you know what? I bet it is still beautiful and aesthetically pleasing. And that's what we're all about in today's video. Whoa. Okay, but it is kind of spooky, though, if I'm being honest. Like, oh, jeez. I think this, is one, this one's a little bit framier than the others. But that's all right. My computer can handle it. Because after all, I am a gamer. Man, look at this. We're in the wastelands. Come across this here. Oh. It truly does feel like I'm in Fallout right now. Like, they did a, an, an incredible job. If I was walking around in Fallout and then I came across something like this, I'd be like, yep. Yeah, it looks about right, you know? Just beautiful. Wow. Okay, let's go inside. So in here, it's a bit of a bunker. The Club Minecraft Bras Room. Club Minecraft Bras. I don't think Minecrafters need bras, do they? Okay, we're sitting in here. Oh, <gasps> looking up at... Oh, wow. This is... Okay. This is quite the... My camera's doing all sorts of things right now. I'm not even touching it. <laughs> this is... Okay, now this person's a gamer. They just got a, a graphics card just sitting on display. Wow. So they, they got a whole TV set up in here, even though, like, they're in the wastelands and it's supposed to be all, like, spooky and terrifying, but it's actually gorgeous. Um, they got a place to do their makeup. Man, and then their ceiling is a galaxy. Wow, I mean, money can't buy ideas like this. Okay, my camera is... <laughs> I don't think I should be in first person. It's kind of, it's having its own issues. Look at this. Oh, there's a little gravestone with a heart on it. They buried their own heart. All right, look at this place. Very cool, I like the little plane model. And then this room. Ah, now this person's a gamer. Yeah, there we go. Okay, there's one thing that I know, guys, it's gaming. I know gaming when I see it. As a matter of fact, believe it or not, that's what we're doing right now. I know, you thought we were in a movie. I know, because of how beautiful this place is. I mean, look at this. Even though it's a terrifying desert wasteland, it's actually gorgeous. You can sit here and I, I would love to live here. You know, as people struggle to survive, I'm up here in my, my tower of gamers. I mean, that's already what I strive for and it's not even the end of the world. <sighs> It is really framey, though. I wish I was as much of a gamer as these guys are. Whoa. See, this room's a little bit more Fallout-y. You know, they got you know, they got a spooky zombie drawing there. Uh, they got some, you know, it's a little bit rustic. Like, literally rusted. Pretty cool. They got a, a sword. Nice. Well, guys, this is... Okay, I... <laughs> It's hard to tell. I'm sure it's hard to tell by watching, but like I will slightly move the camera and then it just like moves on its own for a few seconds. You know what? I just want to go. I want to go to the top. That's what I want to do. I want to get a nice view. Look at this place. It's like a proper outpost. It's so cool. <laughs> wow. Now what's in here? Dad Dev's room. Ooh, a very cute little kitchen. I like it a lot. Being able to look out to the wasteland as you're uh, just using your cutting board. I mean, this is the life, guys. This is it. I think we found it. On top of the outpost with cowardly emeralds. Well, I don't know why you'd call yourself cowardly, you know? America! <laughs> Anyways, guys, don't forget San Pellegrino is a drink that I would drink for money. So, um, if you know San Pellegrino, you want to sponsor me? The offer's right here. I'm, I'm waiting here with open arms. San Pellegrino, CEO. Come on in. Embrace me as I am embracing you and your product. Just this one. The other flavors kind of suck, but the lemon one, very good. Okay. Well, that was Nevada Outpost. It's a lot to handle. It is a lot to handle. And like for my... My old little PC down here, hey, you're doing all right. Tell you what, guys, I don't know which one I want to do. I'm going to, okay, there, there's, there's a bunch to choose from, but I'll do this one. It's by set default one again. This is just like, they just love making these beautiful showcases. That is crazy cool. Whoa. All right, we're in a rainy sci-fi uh, metropolis. Look at this. We're in some sort of cool, epic movie. Very Blade Runner vibes I'm getting from this. Cool. 
Oh man, look at this place. So this has a lot more to do with the outdoors, I suppose. Very, very cool. I like it. Man, this person should be a set designer. They, they really, they really understand aesthetic and vibes. And I think that's important. It's a very important thing to understand. Can I climb this? No, I can't. I think the main thing is just this view here, right? That's sort of the, that's the money shot right there. Bam! These buildings back here too. Let's appreciate that for a second. Beautiful. That was just a nice little taste of a, a, a you know, a kind of nighttime cool city. But I did have my eye on another one, and that was this right here. Oh, and this is now by D3P, or just Deep. This one is very highly rated, and I, you know, I kind of, I had my, I had one of my eyes really locked, and I was really peeled in on this one. Something not by set default one. Interested to see. Okay, and then they got some lo-fi playing. You can see the cursor in the middle. <laughs> no, it looks like a Minecraft texture pack cursor. Okay, so they do they do lock you in first person. The one thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna mute that because it might be copyrighted. Thankfully, Rob can play some equally beautiful. Mi what, the Sharky boy? Where did you come from? Huh? Interesting little rusty room. This guy's going absolutely nuts. Hey man, <laughs> you know what? You, I, I'm gonna be honest. I don't think uh, your your jumping and screaming is really fitting with the vibe right now. I'm just saying. You know, this is a cool little room. I like it. It's a little bit overgrown. I guess it also kind of has like an uh, apocalypsey sort of feel. Splat goes the rat. Oh no, please. No, 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 no. Not this again. Not this again. I need to get out of here. I need to leave. Ah. Uh, uh. Some visions of a dark past. You know what, guys? This last one here, it's also by set default one. Officer K's apartment. Ended off on a more kind of nighttimey feel. Good transition from the nighttime city. I'm excited. Okay. So you enter the apartment. It's looking, um... It looks very kind of futuristic. It's also raining. Very cool. I'm liking this jazz music playing. Cool little kitchen. It's not bad, you know, It's it's got its own sort of feel. Oh, here it is. This is, okay. It all comes together with this one shot right here of eating some ramen, looking out into the rainy city sky. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to thank you so much for joining me for another Roblox adventure. If you enjoyed, please do remember to leave it a like Maybe even subscribe if you haven't already. Don't forget to check out all this merch and all of the new merch that is coming tomorrow on DennisDaily.com. Link in the description below. That is right, guys. There's a countdown timer right now. We got some new merch coming. So go check it out. But uh, that's pretty much it, guys. Again, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you in the next one.